Hello everyone, my name is Aiman Rashid. So today I am going to teach you on syntax hidden phases. What is syntax? So as it is stated there, uh, basically uh, syntax is uh, the study on how uh, words, the smallest unit, can form into a larger unit which is phrases and from the phrases can form another uh, largest unit which we call it as the clause or head. Next, uh, these are the examples of uh, hidden phrases. So we have we have NP, VP, AP, ADVP, and PP. We are going to look uh, at examples later on. So um, next, this is the uh, summary for the phrase structure rules. So in the bracket, it means that it is an optional. So for example, and for NP, we might have determiner, or we might have adjective phrase, or we might have another phrases. For example, verb phrase, under uh, under noun phrase. So we are going to look at the, at the example. So this is the first example. This is the simplest example. So uh, for this uh, example, I feel energized today. When we look at the sentence, we need to break it down uh, into constituent. What is constituent? constituent? Constituent is a group of words that can form a larger unit. So for this example, we have two constituents, which are I and feel energized today. So. Um, <clears throat> And this example, we are going to use head. Uh, we are not going to use clause because um, as uh, we look at the previous um, slide for the phrase such a rules, clause we need to have three. And P as a way of VP. Uh, we, uh, it, uh, it doesn't matter for the phrases. We might have um, another phrases, but we need to have the auxiliary in the middle. So for this example, we don't have any auxiliary verb, verb. So we, uh, we are going to use head. So I. Uh, it's a noun we put on a noun phase. Feel and just today. Uh, so uh, it, it has feel uh, as the starting point for this constituent. So feel is a verb. Then we are going to put uh, feel and just today on the verb phase. So feel is a verb. And just is an verb. Today is an verb for time. Next, uh, this is a more complex example uh, compared to the previous example. So kitty is a lazy white cat. For this example, we have the auxiliary verb, which is is. So uh, we are going to use clause. We, but uh, we can use head. If we are going to use head, we are going uh, we uh, we are going to have only two constituents, which are kitty is a lazy white cat. But uh, here I'm going to uh, show you the difference, uh, uh, the use of uh, the clause, clause and the head. So um, for this example, kitty is a noun, we put it on the noun phase. Is is an auxiliary verb. So a lazy white cat, we have two adjectives there. So we are going to put this constituent under adjective phrase. Uh, and a is a determiner, so a lazy and white are both are adjectives. Uh, cat is a noun, so we put it on the noun phase. So that's it. Thank you.